This is it, guys. It's all empty. Our first house together. And we're on the move. 13 um, years. 13 years. Oh, yeah. By the way, we're moving. I thought I'd share that. <laughs> what is happening, beautiful people? Sister Khalil and Mustafa Islam. If you're watching for the first time, welcome. My name is Zaman. I'm going to do a quick vlog on what's going on. We've moved up now to the Okanagan. Um, we bought a brand new place. I'll do a house tour when it's ready right now. Honestly, it's just a big mess. But um, as you were well aware in my previous spot, I did have a studio slash office space. And in this new house that we bought, there's a space downstairs that was unfinished. And I'll show you that this is going to be my new office. So let's take a look. All right. As you can see, it's all bare right now. And it's a pretty, pretty big space. This stuff wasn't here. Um, this was all done. Quickly frame this up. I'll have a door on this section over here. So there'll be separated spaces from this spot over on to this spot. So as you can see, it's a big space. You know what I mean? So the idea would be to have my office slash on this side and then I'll probably face the desk um, towards the door. That's what I'm thinking, because I want this as my backdrop. I'll build a custom cabin here, have vinyls all the way across. Unfortunately, I did have to put that drop up there because of the, uh, the ventilation and the AC. Um, back here, um, in this spot here, will probably just be storage, I'm thinking, for right now. Uh, but the nice thing is, um, it'll all be drywalled, it'll all be done, it'll all be finished. I'll put some LED lights in here, and this will be, I guess, my, my spot, you know what I mean? So I'm looking forward to this. It's a lot bigger than I had before, which is nice, because the other spot, you know, was great, but it lacked width. Uh, I had the depth, per se, but it didn't, I didn't, it wasn't wide enough. But now, once this gets all boxed in, and once it's all finished, I'm going to have tons of spot which is wicked so nothing will change in terms of um my layout i'll keep my same desk um, i'm not sure how i'm going to orient the studio like i said i am thinking facing that way although ideally probably you know having it this way may make better sense i don't know until it's all done i can look at acoustics i know that drop kind of changes things at the end of the day but whatever i'll make it work i was you know cranking out some some good stuff with the studio that I had before, right? And mainly, I want to get back is into YouTube and stuff. So, I want a nice, I want a nice spot, you know. I want to get some permanent mounted LED lights up so I can just shift them over, shoot some videos, and uh, we're done. I want this, you know, obviously my studio. I want it to be an editing spot, and um, I want to be able to um, get creative again. I got a whole bunch of Funko Pops I've been collecting. I want to mount and put them somewhere to showcase. I'll probably do that maybe on this back wall here. I'm not sure yet. So I got options, you know what I mean? But uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to um, this new journey that we're on. I'm looking forward to, um, you know, getting creative again. I'm really looking forward to, um, you know, making YouTube content again. I don't have a camera yet. And the reason why I waited was because Sony just launched their Sony a7S III, which looks absolutely phenomenal from what I've been seeing on YouTube. So I don't know what I'm going to do. Do I get that or do I get something else? I'm not sure because I do, you know, do do photography as well. So I want to kind of kill two birds with one stone. I'm not sure which route I'm going to go yet. But I mean, at the end of the day, I got to get this done first. This is priority. This is um, where all the magic is going to happen i'm really happy with the space that i got uh you know we chose this place to live for a reason and this is one of the reasons why um i wanted this spot i'm not gonna do any crazy sound installation and that's already insulated what i'll do is on the sides i'll make acoustic panels put them on both sides i'll put some acoustic panels up on top of the ceiling above where i'm gonna sit so once this is all said and done i'll you know put everything down, chalk everything out per se, and then figure out where all my panels are gonna go and then get that done. The biggest problem with recording studios is is bottom end and bass and trying to figure out how to control that. Now, it's not gonna be, you know, 100%, but as long as I do the corners right, which I already have some corner stuff, 
Um, I just gotta raise them, put them up, stick them on, and then I'll figure out these back corners. I'll just make them myself. I don't wanna spend the money on these expensive panels when I figured out how to make them, so I'll do that. Um, but yeah, guys, this is, this is NRG Studios out in the Okanagan in Canada. Coming soon, I'll give you guys an update once it's all said and done. But I uh, just want to shoot this quick video let you guys know that, you know, we're up in the Okanagan now. We've moved and we're done. I'm so looking forward to life out here. And I'll do some more videos. I'll do some more vlogs and, um, you know, keep the content going. But I want to say if you're watching this video for the very first time, you know, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Please subscribe part of the family. If you want to see more vlogs just like this, please click on the on the sky. Of course, my peeps, be you. Stay optimistic. Enjoy the rest of your night. This is a big high five for me to all of you.